Yes, I think one of my biggest strengths uh, as a caster is that I really know the scene really well, I know the history, I know what everyone's playing, and I think it's really important to impart that knowledge uh, to the viewers. Tell them, uh, because the viewers, they don't have all the time to watch Hearthstone games and watch every Hearthstone match, so you kind of uh, are the, the, I guess, the portal between all those matches and the viewers. I have to say, like, right now I'm in a place where I'm just, I'm really happy about who I am and uh, where I am. Alright guys, this is pretty much the biggest league, almost like the biggest Hearthstone tournament that there's ever been. So guys, if you want to support Hearthstone, if you just want to watch some awesome games, if you want to support the team, guys, check out this league. It's going to be amazing, I know it. Hey guys, welcome back. Hope you guys enjoyed that little uh, briefing from the monk. Uh, getting into our game here, Cloud9 versus Team Archon. Um, what, what, what do you guys think uh, these guys should open up with? Uh, we've seen mostly like just strong decks in the openers so far. You kind of want to get like on the board early. Is that kind of the idea? Like you never really see like a team open up with a priest. Well, it's not as though many people brought priests in the first place. I think the only players that played it is like you have Dog, Gara, and I think Shocky one week where everybody was just mind blown because he decided to bring what we just wouldn't ever expect him to. Um, and it never quite worked out. So I, I expect people to start with all around good classes. And Colento's probably bringing out uh, Grim Patron Warrior. So yeah, I think a momentum. Momentum is just a very important thing, um, and you do have to win with all the classes at least once, so you might as well just start with the best